Calling you the day after your first date. Friggin' stalker. <laughs> Why did you lie to them? Do you have any idea how much work we have left to do before, before it's perfect? Perfection doesn't interest me, Bella. Practical results do. We still need to tackle a number of significant problems before we can attempt an operation of any magnitude. Oh, really? Such as? Override strong personal feelings between prospective subject and target, oh, for one. Details. Excuses. I have spent my entire adult life in this technology, and I'm not going to see it compromised by half measures. You're right. We must be responsible, Bella. We rise together. We fall together. But if we fall, you fall first. Chris? You okay? Uh, yeah. Lady with the gun? Been a while? Don't make too much of it. It's just a dream. No, uh, you know, like, sometimes there's a word and it's right on the tip of your tongue, but you can't think of it. This lady is... It's like she's right on the tip of my brain. It's like I know her. But how? Thing in here. Yeah, right. Like, I'm gonna leave it outside in this neighborhood. Dude, just dude, just give me a tall Americano to go, all right? Hey, Jordy. What's up? Stop. Didn't you break your pelvis or something? Yeah, uh, it chipped it. Hurt like hell. No biggie. Not like the ribs. Man, every time I go over a pothole, I think I'm gonna black out. <laughs> oh, and, and thanks for not popping by to check up on me. Yeah, thanks for telling my dad I got busted by the cops. Uh, just sort of slipped past the painkillers. Right. Yeah, how'd that work out anyway? Well, I'm under house arrest. I got midterms, you tell me. No, 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 I mean with the cops. Uh, remember that pyramid? Yeah, the one you was hitting on while I was dying on the sidewalk? Turns out her dad's a detective, got the charges dropped. You gotta be the luckiest guy on the face of the planet. So then we go to dinner. Oh, look at you, player, all 007 and stuff, eh? Well, turns out, she's great. Really? We talked for like three hours. Well, and uh, I'm glad I had the opportunity to introduce you guys. Yeah, me too. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> What's your name? Ready. Oh, man. What? You're in love. Shut up. Because the way you said it, Rennie. I mean, it sounded like you were in love. Well, that's her name. No, 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 no. I'm not saying about my name. I'm saying about the way you said it. The way you said Rennie. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where are you guys going? Manhattan. Your dad's taking me out to dinner. Huh. On a Wednesday night? What, is it against the law for us to go out on a Wednesday night? Your dinner's on the stove. We'll bring you back some dessert. Okay, then. Have fun.
What are you doing here? It was your mom's idea. She figured you gotta eat, so why not eat with a friend? <laughs> Can't believe she did this. I can go if you need to study no, or... No, no. Oh, no, you don't. No, I did. Did you make this? No, your mom did, but I helped with the salad. You're gonna work hard. Do awesome on your exams. And we'll see you Friday. taking me huh what do you want what do you want just tell me what you want i don't have any money i don't have anything christopher moore <laughs> age 24 born october 15th 1986 no 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 you got the wrong guy i was born in july july 2nd my id's in my wallet let me don't you guys are making a huge mistake you're currently studying law at columbia university you reside at 20 east 25th street legal guardians frank edward and pam elizabeth more. Eagle Guardians, what do you mean? What are you talking about? Who are you people? Please. Please come with me. I'll explain. Come. I want you to see something. Twenty years ago, a boy was found scavenging food from a dumpster in Chinatown. It was placed in the custody of child services. It was later determined he had suffered a concussion. He had no memory of his parents, where he came from. Even his name was a mystery. That child was subsequently adopted by Frank and Pam Moore. So you're saying this kid was you? Yes. <laughs> no, you know what, this is ridiculous. 10 days ago when you were arrested, the police collected a routine DNA swab. They entered it into CODIS. This generated a match to your biological parents. I assure you, the results were checked and rechecked. They're irrefutable. Your birth name is Kit Walker. Kit Valker. You were born in Gstaad, Switzerland, and named after your father, who was a very important man was? Yes. He died 22 years ago. 
cancer. <laughs> okay. Okay. So what you're saying is I'm not me, my parents aren't my parents, and my real father is dead. I know this is difficult. No, 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 this is not difficult, this is insane. I don't even know who you people are. Fair enough. <laughs> we represent an agency known as Ba Tha. Ba what? In 1664, one of your ancestors and a former pirate named Ba well, I'm, I'm sorry, a pirate? <laughs> a former pirate established a small paramilitary group whose mandate was to protect the innocent against violence and oppression. Since then, it has grown into an international covert intelligence and law enforcement agency located in Bengala. Oh, Bengala? Mm -hmm. A small island nation in the Indonesian archipelago. Oh, I know where it is. 